solve system of equations graphically using the TI 83 and the intersect method. Example solve graphically the system of equations y is equal to the log of x plus 3 and y is equal to x squared. Here's the calculator solution. First we'll enter each equation into the calculator so we'll use the y equals function we'll place our y sub 1 equation as the first equation in our system the log of x plus 3 and I'll close off the argument for the logarithm and for y sub 2 I'll put in the second equation x squared next we're going to graph so you can either graph using the graph or the zoom 6 which is the zoom standard so for this example I'm simply going to use zoom in 6 and what this does is it place my x and y axis running from negative 10 to positive 10 in intervals or increments of 1 so next we see that there are two points of intersection so we zoom in on the points of intersection so I'm going to hit zoom and I'm going to use this first option which is zoom box and I'm going to press enter next we're going to find a corner of our box so notice that the cursor should be blinking at the origin my crosshairs so in order to find the first corner of my box I'm simply going to go down and to the left and I'm going to press enter and now I'm going to find a second a third and a fourth corner of my box so from this point I'm going to go up and to the right and I intend to zoom in this box so now I'm simply going to press enter now your coordinates may not be exactly as my coordinates but your graph should look as such now we're going to find the first point of intersection going to use the second and trace which is the calculate function so that second and trace I'm going to scroll down to my fifth option which is the intersect and I'm going to press enter it acts for a first curve so notice that my cursor is on that first curve of our equation the log of x plus 3 so I'm simply going to force my cursor close to one of my intersection points so I'm going to move it to the left it doesn't have to be actually on the intersection point but close to it and now I'm going to press enter it acts for a second curve so now notice that my cursor is on my second curve of our system x squared so we're going to press enter it acts for a guess here we simply hit enter and we have our points of intersection next we'll find the next point of intersection so we'll sort of repeat the process we'll use second and trace which is the calculate function again we're going to calculate the intersection it acts for a first curve so we're going to force our cursor toward our next point of intersection I'm going to press enter it asks for a second curve 
so I'm now on the second curve of my system I'm simply going to press enter because I'm near that point of intersection it asks for a guess and for guess we always hit enter and we have our points of intersection next let's solve graphically the system of equations y is equal to e raised to the x plus one and x plus y is equal to three so I'll simply clear my calculator and I'll go back to the home screen here's the calculator solution we're going to enter each equation into our calculator I'm going to clear out those equations for y sub 1 and y sub 2 and I'm going to put in exponential e raised to the x plus 1 and for y sub 2 I have to solve this equation for y so I'm going to transpose x so y sub 2 I'm going to put in negative x plus 3 next I'm on a graph using the zoom 6 so now we're going to find the first point of intersection so we're going to use second and trace which is the calculate function we're going to scroll down to the fifth option which is intersect we're going to press enter so notice it asks for a first curve and it's on the first curve of our system we press enter it asks for a second curve it's now on the second curve of our system we press enter it asks for a guess again we press enter and we have our ordered pair solution